Hi guys, I just want to do a quick video review of Katie's Bubbles Soap, which I recently acquired. We have LPV here and Flow here. Um, let me tell you at the onset, both these scents are very nice. The LPV is rather unique. I can't describe it other than to say I like it. It lingers a bit, which I actually like too. The Flow is a subtle orange light scent. It's very nice. It's not overpowering. It's not Don Marco, but it's a nice scent. In terms of performance, these guys perform extremely well. Uh, there's no problems whatsoever. I'll throw up a lathering pick for you guys just to give you an idea of how, how it lathers. Um, once you do get it lathered, no disappearing lather, no problems. It's plenty slick enough. Um, you can shave well with it, no issues at all. It's on par with all the rest of the artists and soaps in terms of performance. When you look at cost, these are $20, but it's 8 ounces. Um, it's slab full. Let me show you the amount of product in the container. There's a lot of product in there. Slab full. Nice thick container. So for $20, I'd say it's priced reasonably. Uh, it's not overly expensive. It's not the cheapest soap, but artisan soaps aren't. Um, in terms of shipping, which is important to me and a lot of wet shavers, he ships fast. You get your product fast. That means a lot to me. Thank you, Chris. I wish other soap makers, some of them, would ship as fast as you do, and I hope you continue to do the great job shipping that you are. So overall, I'd give these products um, the LPV. I give it a 9 out of 10. I like it that much. The Flow, I would give it an 8, only because I prefer the Don Marco scent, but this is still really good stuff. If you like orange, you're probably going to like it. It's light, but it's great. These are great soaps. Um, they're not mentioned a lot, but I would suggest that you guys try them out. Now that I've got that done, I wanted to talk a little bit about a soap that I just received today that I haven't had a chance to try yet. This one's called... Um, Le Pierre Lucien, or LPL. Um, I got to tell you, just based on scent, I haven't used it. It's disappointing. Uh, this, I guess, is unscented. It has no discernible scent whatsoever. Maybe it's great. I guess we'll see when I use it, but initial impressions are not very favorable in terms of scent on this. I also received some Avocado Taylor's Vol Bond Street Cream. Very favorable feelings about that. It smells great. It smells clean, fresh. It's got a wonderful smell. I'm 100% sure I'll like this cream because Tob's creams, they lather wonderfully. So thank you guys for watching. I would ask that everybody, if you're not a member of the Wet Shaver Enablers group on Facebook, join. We're having a big giveaway on April 15th. We're going to be giving away a lot of stuff, some handmade brushes, handmade soap. So if you haven't joined us, please do. I'll put some comments at the bottom about that. Also, please subscribe to my channel. I'm going to be doing more reviews. I'm not going to be doing shaving because we've all seen people shaving. You can go watch Mantic. You can go watch Michael Freeberg. You can go watch Geo Fat Boy. Um, they're wonderful in their videos and instruction in terms of shaving technique. I just want to talk about products, and that's really what a lot of us uh, wet shavers who've been shaving for a while like to talk about products. How can we get that ultimate shave? So, With that, I thank you again for watching the video. Have a great day.